here we go. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making his way to the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 255 pounds, O. Lee Anderson. You know, I know for a fact that there are a number of people in the locker room who dread getting in the ring with this superstar. Well, Byron, every superstar in that locker room is being paid to compete, so spare me the sob story. He said he'll be making a statement in this match tonight and will deliver it emphatically. Here we go, guys. And his opponents, first, representing the Brain Busters from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Weighing in at 225 pounds, Tully Blanchard. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. The competition level has never been higher, but this guy's ready to prove he can hang. Now, I've been looking forward to this one. And representing the Brain Busters from Minneapolis, Minnesota, Weighing in at 255 pounds, Arn Anderson. We've heard a lot from this individual and how important loyalty is, but it's not always clear where their loyalties lie. Maybe they're loyal to themselves. Maybe it's to their mom. Maybe it's to your mom. What difference does it make? Well, maybe they're loyal to evil. Don't be such a child. He is physically and mentally prepared for the task at hand in this big time match. And from Charlotte, North Carolina, Weighing in at 243 pounds, the Nature Boy, Ric Flair. Take a look at the talent in competition here. You can see exactly why the WWE Universe is so amped up for this one. He calls himself the standard bearer of this division and plans on proving it in a matter of moments.
this no disqualification match. Nothing is off limits here. This is the perfect setting for a superstar to fight without any regard for the rule book. And more importantly, any regard for their opponent. It wasn't the height or distance that caused the damage, but they certainly contributed. really shouldn't count on anyone but yourself in this kind of situation. A massive atomic drop. Oh, the physicality on display there. Unbelievable. Oh, and a right hand for good measure. Oh, well-planted knee. Ouch. You go up, you have to come down. Showing him what a real alpha male looks like. And he sends him into the corner. He's taking this to the floor now. Big four. Corey, what are the perils of this match that superstars must be concerned with? Now, this is the type of setting where you must be aware of outside interference because when it's no disqualification, it's not considered interference. He's got the shoulders down. Not quite there yet. He needs to deal more damage before trying that again. Right to the leg. Throws the opposition back into the ring. Oh, close line. Oh. Oh, side headlock applied. Oh, oh and a right hand for good measure. Oh. Lighten up the chest. He is a sight to behold. Take a picture while you can, everyone. Here comes the atomic drop. He's absorbed some damage already. That's unnecessary. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Having a weakened arm can limit you in so many. And he goes for the pin. Getting the shoulder up before two. Fighting hard to stay in this match. Oh, man, he's got the kendo stick. Everyone needs to watch out now. Ugh, that'll scratch you up. He should. 
brought back into the ring from the floor now. Set up for the side rush and leg sweep. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. him back in now. He is revving up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. He went right into that turnbuckle. Nothing fancy here. In the ring now. He's in a bad way, guys. Yeah, not looking good at all. Boom! Slam! With authority. Knee right to the gut. Time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. What's he got in store? Does he get it here? And he stops the count. Range down an elbow retaliation. Waist lock. No, no. And this match would have been over. Letting his opponent know respect is earned, and he's still a dollar short. Caught in a bad position here. Face first. He's going to the pin. This could be it. And he fights it off. How? How? He gets back into the ring. Nelson applied. Face Buster! And he continues to attack with aggression as this match goes on. This is him reminding everyone of the fighting spirit he possesses. Up and oh, what a gut buster. Uh, knee first. <laughs> Kendo in hand. That means he's hardcore. He'll take him all on. Thing. We're at a stage where someone's going to have to shift it into another gear. Nightmare. Oh, 
Oh, about a knee drop. Oh, a fracture in orbital. Absolutely no respect on his opponent. You gotta love it. Treating the torso to yet another attack. And more attacks to his core could hinder his offense. And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. And an inverted atomic drop. No laser focused on the temple and back of the neck. Up they go! Oh, the tonic drop! And more attacks to his core could hinder his offense. There's some power behind that punch. Oh, raking the back. That's nasty. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Flashing through the table. You can literally see his soul leave his body as he crashed through the table. I have no idea how he's going to manage to go on in this one. He has been here before, and he knows what he needs to do. Oh, a right hand for good measure. Nothing fancy here. Back breaker. Back breaker. Oh. It's always disoriented, taking those hits above the shoulders. And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. Scary pass starting to form as that upper area takes more damage. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Look at the arm for a Fujiwara armbar. He steps foot in the ring again. Oh, Fujiwara armbar applied. Here's a cover. Could be it. And he stops the count. Lucky him. Waist lock. No, no. Belly to belly. My goodness. And the hits to the core keep coming. Oh, look at this here. Arm wrench. Oh, this is not good at oh, all. The pendulum backbreaker stretch. Just in the nick of time. Oh, shit breaker. Gentlemen, it's time to go to school. Woo! There it is. Leg lock. Uh, he breaks up the hold. Take a good look at a real-life Titan, folks. Here he goes for the win. And he closes it out. Gets the fatal four-way win. Here is your winner, the Nature Boy, Ric Flair. What a finale to this intense fatal four-way match. An amazing performance outlasting three different opponents. It was a real testament to his abilities.